Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you are doing great. Okay, in the last video, we discussed that what is coding. Okay, and I even told you what is text-based and block-based coding. In the same video, I told you that uh, we will be starting with Scratch. Uh, this is the name of a platform. Okay, it is a block-based coding. Okay, so we'll be starting from uh, from that platform. So I have opened this um, a new Chrome page. Okay, and I'll firstly I'll show you how to create your ID, how to open Scratch, and how to create your ID over there. All right. So um, let's start. So firstly, I'll just search over here. I'll just type Scratch. Okay, and once you have written, just press Enter. Okay. So in the first uh, first option itself, I got this website. Okay, Scratch Imagine Program Show. I put the website link in the description as well. You can directly click on that link and you can go to this website. Okay, but uh, I'll even show you how you can go without the link also. So now this is the website that I was talking about. All right. Now, if you look over here, you'll see, see that, okay, uh, these are some of the projects that are created by other people. Okay, you can also create your projects. You can also, you know, publish them. You can also launch them. You can share them. You can click on any of these projects if you want to see any of them. You want to play the game. You can just simply click on them and you can try them. All right. So I'm not going to open any of these uh, right now. My main aim is to show you that how to create your ID over here. So now at the top, we have these two options. One option is to join Scratch. Join Scratch is for those who are totally new, who are new to Scratch and they don't have the ID. Sign in is for those who already have their ID and they want to go inside their ID. So we are new to this platform so we, we, i and i want to create my id so i'll click on join scratch now uh, you have to create a username now username can be your own name or it can be anything else also it is your wish what is uh, what username you want to keep okay i'll keep the uh, username as our classes so it is coding classes so Okay, so it is saying that username is not allowed. So let's try to put a space. If that works, it cannot have space. So let's try to put a number over here. So that is also not allowed. So what should we put? Um, Okay, CC107, we got our username. Okay, so now we need to create a password. Okay, so uh, you have to keep a password that you can remember. Okay, so what password should we create over here? Okay, I'll just hide my password. Okay, so no one can see it. Okay, now I have uh, written my password. You have to type the same password at both the places. Okay, and now we'll click on this next. I'll just save it. You can just click on save. So your browser will just save the password. You don't have to remember it. Okay, so I'll just save it. Now select the country. Uh, so you can find your country over here. I'm from India. So I'll select India and next. So, um, yeah, next. Female. And uh, next. 
now email address now this is very important if you don't have your email address you can ask your parents to give their email address to you okay so you have to put that email address over here okay you do okay done create my account so welcome and get started done okay now here we can see a message is there that confirm your email to enable sharing all right so i have to confirm my email so what i'll do is see here scratch is open here is a plus button so just click on this plus button okay now with whatever email id you had put over there you have to open that mail id your parents can help you with that if you don't have your own mail id so i'll just open that mail id over here that i had put okay you just need to wait a little bit scratch will send you a message over there okay you can click on this confirm so they are seeing that they have uh, they have already sent it confirm uh, by clicking on the link all right so might be i'll have to just wait over here all right so now uh, as you can see over here that i go got this uh, mail so confirm your scratch account so i'll just click on it you can also do this from your mobile phone but try to use a laptop for this because you'll get a link over here to click on so try to use a laptop or a mobile phone for this purpose okay so now confirm my email address click on this button okay so it is saying that uh, you have confirmed your email address okay now okay uh, so i'll just click on okay and let's go and i'll just close this one because i don't need this and this also i'm just closing because i don't need this so this is my scratch id your scratch id is ready to work okay now um you can explore this platform a little bit so at the top there are some uh, buttons that we have all right so uh, this is how you create your id on scratch okay so in the next video i'll show you how you can start creating your projects on scratch okay for this video we'll keep it till here only i hope um, you understood each and every step and it, it's easy for you to uh, start your scratch journey all right so let's keep it till here so if you like the video please click on the like button and please subscribe to my channel and uh, we'll continue the series and i'll put all the videos that are related to scratch in one playlist so you can find it at one place and in future it will not be difficult for you to uh, you know get this course and uh, take it step by step okay so every video will be uh, you know step by step you have to start from first then go to the second then third try not to skip the videos okay so this was the first video in the next video i'll show how you can create your project how you can start and i'll also show you where to create a project all right okay so let's keep it till here all right then bye take care